Someone, please! Thanks. Get to treat me. We'll be safe with him. to save. We are running out of time. My wife, please, leave me be! Not me! My wife! Save her first! I have to... Oh, my dear Hilda, why? I cannot live without you. I cannot bear to go on. Forgive me. There... There's nothing you can do now. There's nothing you can do now. Get to safety. Quickly, everyone! Get the wounded to take me! He's by the gates! Come quick! Help anyone you can! Please! 
Must be blocked from the other side. Eivor, where are Thank you? Thank you. Get over here. Move. Move. Get to safety. Billy, where are To clear a path. I will get the man, Eivor. You carry the woman. If I will have to wait, you are staying here today. <laughs> oh, thank thee, all father. Hold on to me. I can get you out. I thought I might have to rescue you, Willy. Had I died, it would have been my time. My fate is already spun. I'm sorry, but you cannot endanger yourselves like this, lords. You have people to lead, a future to consider. The old man has wisdom, Willy. You have the full weight of this clan on your back. My father carries that weight. I do the fighting and feasting, and I am expert at both. It's good to have you watching my back again, Eivor. You see what I deal with, Eivor? The mind of a troll in the body of an Aesir. <laughs> Still the same arse stick as when we were children. I'll never change. This is hardly the time for lightness, you two. We have many injured to comfort. Well, that is your domain, Trigvi. I don't wish to be seen as a savior and healer all in one afternoon. The waters at Kinder Doonfall will soothe my wounds. If my father needs me, I'll be there. Billy, stop! Eivor, wait a moment. Heminga Jarl has confided in you about his health. He has. He said Billy wasn't taking it well. Billy lives in another world entirely right now. He is cracked inside and will not face the full truth laid before him. And how are you? Have you braced yourself for what is to come? I... I have made my peace with the future, yes. Worry yourself with the wounded here. I will talk to Willy myself. No block in the path. Move on. <laughs> 
Willy was right. The kinder downfall. Willy was right. The kinder downfall is beautiful. Now where is he? Found my secret haunt. I would be deaf to have not heard your singing. Your crow's craggle could awaken the dead. <laughs> These skirmishes with the picks, they've worn you down. Not at all. The more scars, the better the boast. I mean, look at my father, a battle worn veteran carved up like a goat on a spit. Not a metaphor I'd use just now. Not in his state. These waters are magnificent, no? They comfort and heal. They are Freya's gift to man. Lily, you need to face it. Your father is dying. When he departs for the corpse hall, you will take his place, as expected. The novelty of this soggy north has worn on me, Eivor. Too warm for winter living, too cold for summer. I've heard Mercia is more temperate. Dense forests, bright colors, thriving streams. Is that how it is in your settlement? You defy a long tradition, Billy. The son takes after his father. That is the way of things. Eivor... I have my own reasons to see you made Jarl. The Raven Clan wants friends in England. You are among my very best. You do not need me in that seat to secure an alliance. You and Sigurd are beloved here. Your father is dying, Billy. Now is the time to get your house in order. It is not my house. It is the clan's house, and the clan will decide what happens next. You have a chance to end on good terms with your father. I wasn't afforded the same luxury. Don't squander it. Billy! Billy! Come forth! Another attack? It's your father! He hasn't got long! Come to the longhouse! Yal is at the edge of death. I must see him before he goes.
Will Henning Garial go to heaven, Mother? I, oh. I hope he will. If he has accepted Christ into his heart, the Lord will most certainly receive him. To see you both together again like this, it recalls days long past, makes me feel young again. Hold on to that feeling, and take it with you to the Hall of the Slain. You have become a great warrior, Eivor. A warrior and a leader. Worth, worth song and verse. I had many good teachers, Hemingar Jarl. You, chief among them. I beg of you now. Do not... Let my lessons die. Pass them on. The seer is on her way, father. She has remedies for you. Cures and charms. I held you here, really. In one proud hand when you were fresh from your mother's womb. I watched you grow. Dirty-haired boy, swinging sticks and running through the mud, dreaming of glory. I... I am proud of what you have become, son. <laughs> and I am proud proud of what you will become, no matter, I, uh, I, uh, uh. Father, Willy. We must prepare for the funeral. I'll send for my clan. You call on the nobles of the Shire. The nobles have begun to arrive. Trigve needs our help to see this through. We will be at the funeral pyre, overlooking the village.
see pyre for him in her yard. His journey to the halls will be heralded by roaring flames. Should a new threat to Hemthorpe emerge, who will step up to meet it? Really? I'm not sure. Eivor. Drengur. Suniva, thank you for coming. Ah, oh, the sight of old friends lets my heart rest easy. We came as soon as we heard, bearing gifts for Hemingur Jarl. The celebration will last many days. How soon shall we begin? The pyre's construction is underway, and all of our guests are lodged and welcomed. We could begin shortly. Good. You handled this well, Trikve. I pledged my life's oath to Hemingur Jarl. There is nothing I would not do for him. The all thing must be held when the week is out and the funeral is done. The nobles of this shire will name Vili the Jarl of our clan. This assumes they will be sober after a week of drinking and weeping. It will be a grand funeral. Father will have a clear view of his lands from here. The flames will burn bright and tall for all the shire to see. You've done well, Trigger. This was his favorite spot in the Shire. I suppose we should get started. Our guests need looking after. I will look for you later, to save you from them, once the mead has really soaked in. You are a true gift, Eivor. Thank you. Trigvi is Hemthorpe's rock. With him around, the city can keep its peace. He's a good man. I must be away for a short time, Eivor. I want to retrieve something for my father. A gift. When did you have time to make a funeral gift? <laughs> it was something I had hoped to give him in life. You must see it to believe it. I brought a gift from the Raven Clan. I stored it at the watchtower on the far side of Hemthorpe. Very kind, thank you. I should like to see it. I should look over the gift first. It must be worthy of hemming Ayal. There's a heaviness to your look, Eivor. What troubles you? Himminger desired my counsel before he died. Wanted my opinion on the future of this clan's leadership. That would be Vili, would it not? If tradition held, yes. Trikvi has tasked me to help the Volva with the sacrifices. Could we speak with her to ease your thoughts? It is a good idea, but let me go alone. Set scouts around the village. The people here must mourn in safety.
With Heminger Yard gone, can Lily hold the reins? Will he guide us through? You are the wolf-kissed one. The raven of battle whose fame grows with each waxing of the moon. I struggle with the choice Heminger left for me. I would have your counsel on the matter. A slaughter must be made. Many sheep at the bottom of the sleeping Jutten. Before the pyre is lit. Follow. <laughs> Come, creatures. You are to serve the gods and bid them welcome our beloved Hemingriart with ale and open arms. You have the gift of foresight, Seer. Can you augur what is to come? I see what need be seen, when it need be. A great gift. A great burden. <laughs> Did Heminger Jarl consult you often? Did he unburden his woes? We spoke often. Yet too often he left with more burdens than he brought. He worried about the future of his clan. About who would be Jarl. Speak less. Lest our words draw foul spirits to dog us. As you wish. <laughs> Volva, I... Your heart is restless. Your mind clouded. You seek more than a guarantee of good omens. I seek the gods' wisdom. You wish to know who would best serve this clan as Jarl? I do. Between Vili and Trigvi, there is no clear choice. We stand in the shadow of the giant, the great keeper of secrets. Here, you'll find a drink of the resounding sea. Ascend the sleeping Jutten, consume the waters, and meditate at its peak. Do not seek answers to your questions. They will find you. This is an outrage! Festive. Too festive. And too soon. Fires, fights, and every man soaked in mead. Ugh, this has gone too far. Hemthorpe could burn before the pyre is lit. Gods, have I failed, my dear Jarl? Peace, Trickvi. I'll do what I can to calm things. What is this Voda you speak of? A gift without price, fit for a Jarl's lips. But hurry, it catches flame. Help! Fire! Save my Voda, it burns! Help! Fire! Save my Voda, it burns! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you! 
was too late for your... your Voda, as you say. Ah, balls. I dragged it all the way from Rus. It is back to water ale for me, I suppose. If you drink enough, ale is a fine fix to any problem. Very true, very true. Join me if you desire. A bit of drink in the belly never hurt. Sobbing sack of meat with the roosters. What an arsehole. What see you, old friend? I didn't see them coming. I never looked down. I never saw them coming! Flee, warrior, flee! Loki's horde lays waste here! You mean Hemminger's famous fighting roosters? Dragons with mighty claws! Save me from their wrath! Thank you, mighty Thor. You've saved my life. When you sober up, steer clear of roosters. Insult our culture. He's a dead man if I ever cast about this land, my friend. What? How dare he insult our culture? He's a dead man if I ever get my hands on him. They are going to kill him. I told him not to do it. Come out, you dung eating rat! What madness is this? You dare wash our beloved Hemingir with your filth! I asked you a question, friend. There's a Saxon within. One stupid enough to try sending Hemingir to heaven over Valhalla. Now he cowers behind a locked door! I only did right by his immortal soul! You will get what is right for you! Calm yourselves, all of you. I'll speak with him, unmask his true intentions. Get that stain out here now! People are quite upset. Leave me be! I did nothing wrong! You should walk out of here, on your own, before you cannot walk at all. Yes, yes, I'll walk, I'll walk! Don't hurt me, please! There's a key there. If you open the door, I... I will follow you out. <laughs> You've got the key! Use it! You pay 
for your wrongs, desecrator. Enough. Let him speak to explain himself. I loved Heminger. I swear. I only want him to fly free in the kingdom of God. So you drench his body with your filth waters? Is it your Christian holy water? Of course. I anointed him in the name of the Lord. Never inflict your Christian mysteries on a dead Norseman. But I only... These are your neighbors. Respect them, learn their ways, and you will draw breath long into old age. Oh no! There you are. Baptized as one of us. Some order seems to have been restored. Now to trick thee, to let him know. I have calmed the guests as much as they can be in their grief. They mourn. It is to be expected. Still, thank you. And how do you feel, old friend? I mourn more deeply than most, I think. Heming, I would be proud of what you have accomplished here. All you have done for him. I hope so. This ache will pass, Trikvi. With time. Yes, it will. Here, from the Raven Clan. An impressive shield. It is good, but it needs a touch of grandeur, something personal for your father. A sigil, I think. A mark to adorn the front. We need an artisan. Is there one in the village? I know a man. A master craftsman in exile. He lives in a cave northeast of Hemsop. I would take you there myself, but I have Isbjorn to retrieve. Isbjorn? Your father's spear? Did he not wield it at Ulkethorpe? He lost it some winters back on a bear hunt. He hit the beast hard, but the spear stuck and the bear fled into the forest. And after all these winters, you hope to find it again and present it to the pyre. The odds are narrow, to say the least. <laughs> Fret not, friend. I have a nose for these things. Seek out the exile. He'll see to your shield. Head on to the cavern, Eivor. East beyond awaits me elsewhere.
exile must value his solitude living in a hole such as this. Difficult man to find. Uh. Heming Ayal is dead. Mm. I was told you're a master craftsman. I seek an etching on the shield to celebrate the life and death of Heming Ayal. The stones. Heming Ayal possessed a steady hand and steady heart. Do you possess the same? <sighs> <sighs> Life it did not, but in death it lies as still as a stone. You have not yet answered me. Will you help me with my etching? His unrivaled prowess on the battlefield. Ah, Gunknir, then. Odin's faultless spear, a symbol of power. Is this your choice? Yes, I choose this one. I will begin. How did you come to be here? Fate. I was given a death sentence. Unfairly, I felt. But a man was killed. Heming Jarl desired for me to live. The villagers... did not. My sight and exile. That was our compromise. Thank you for this. His son will take his place? That is for Vili to decide. Vili has no say. Fate has already decided. Heminger would be pleased with our gift. I wonder if Vili has found his spear.
Heming Ayal. Is it truly you? Of spirit, not of flesh. Why have you not reached Odin's hall? I've well in time. As the flames of my pyre burn, I will ride the path of all smoke to the All Father's Hall of Champions. I am grateful to see you once more, Jarl. A struggle with the task you set before me. To choose your heir is not an easy thing. One man is beloved, but does not want the task. The other man is fit for the task, but is not favored. I could not give you any more counsel in life, A4. So too in death am I rendered silent. Forget wise counsel and rational arguments. What does your heart tell you? My heart is stopped. It says nothing. This should not be my decision, Heminger. The choice was always yours to make. You were their chief. As Sigurd is your chief. But that does not quench your appetite for glory, as you covet his place upon the high seat of your clan. I do not seek to replace Sigurd. Fate weaved our futures long ago. We're only following its pattern. Yet you see it coming. You welcome it. Shall I renounce my fate, then? Abandon the path to glory I walk? No. I want you to die in defense of it. Shire's fate is uncertain. I trusted you to make the right decision. I still do. You pushed me, Heminger. I never intended this. <laughs> have no regrets, A4. You have given me the great battle death I sought in life. You old fox. Was that the point of riling me up?
did you consult the Volvo? And were your questions answered? Some questions were answered. Others I must answer myself. Do you think there is a place for Willy in our settlement? He expressed a desire to live and work with us. Will he not be Jarl of this Shire before the day's end? That remains to be seen. Some are more eager to see Trygvi in the high seat. Eivor, Trygvi has no intention to lead. He feels duty-bound to follow his master into death. Absolutely not. My father would never allow such foolishness. How else can I honor my Jarl? Old as I am. This is no country for me. The future is yours, Vili. The flames of this pyre will burn for my father. You must live. I forbid you to follow him into death. I will not let you sacrifice yourself. Do you forbid me as a friend, Vili? Or as our new Jarl? As a man who would see you come to your senses. Vili. Trigvi. Each man wears one of Hemminger's boots, with both men unwilling to seize the other. Does the world need such useless, dithering men? Why not stake a claim yourself? Take this shire of your own. It is not my place. Your place is anywhere you lay your head, any hill you summit, any silver you take for your own. Do not limit yourself to niceties. Snottinghamshire deserves a leader to admire. A man the people can trust. Most love Billy, and he loves them. But he lacks the will to be leader. He could learn. But does he wish to? And Trigvi, sturdy and wise, and loyal to the legacy Hemminger Jarl left behind. Almost to a fault. But he is old, and his thrill for living has fled him. Hardly inspiring. You cannot! I will not allow it! I am not asking for your permission. Only your forgiveness. Gods, Eivor, put a stop to this fool's death wish. Trigvi has no Jarl to serve, Vili. He's free to set his own course to the ocean's edge, to trade this world for the next. As are you, Vili. Our lives belong to us. Thank you. Thank you, Eivor. Vili, do not misplace your anger on friends who speak what they believe is truth. <sighs> do as you must, Trivi. I... I will miss you, old friend. And I you. My boy. I must prepare myself for the flames, body and spirit. <laughs> 